So hey guys, this is the third episode of me playing Monica After Story and giving Monica nicknames. If you didn't check out the last two episodes, you should. And a link to the last episode should appear on your screen right about now. So basically, I remember that I called her God in a previous episode, and I believe one of you said though that she might react differently to Goddess instead of God, so I'm trying that right now. Okay, so we're getting a generic response. If you don't mind, I'm going to basically skip through the generic responses really fast because we've been through them already. Yeah, that didn't get a different response either. So the full word Dan Salvado won't fit in, but I could fit in Salvado, so I'm going to try that. But there's no real new reaction. Really? She's okay with being called Andre? I didn't think... Oh well, I guess they didn't program that in. Akinam is just Monica backwards and well I guess I didn't really expect them to have programmed something for that so there you go really I just friend zoned you and that's what you're saying So I've called her mom and mommy, but one person requested I try Mamika to see if that would also get, yeah, it got the same response as mommy and mom. So there are three ways to get that response. I don't think I've called her honey before. And that gets one of the good responses. Girlfriend won't fit. Well, it's a space at least. Someone asked that I call her a trap, and understandably she's really mad about that.
So let's call her something nice this time. I've been told calling her my Monica is considered to be a good thing. So yeah. And so is my darling as well. Alyssa, I think, was one of the characters, you know, like on that website, I forgot, there's some easter egg in DDLC. She doesn't seem to respond differently to Queen that she did with Princess. Maybe she doesn't want to look old or something. So that gets one of the good reactions. Well actually there's only one real good reaction. The other one is just sort of okay. And the other two are bad. I got the request to call her Senpai. I'm not sure if it's spelled with an M or with an N. I've seen it done both ways. I can try both. But up till now all I've gotten is a generic response. Poor spelling matters so let me try with an N. Nope, no difference. Well, she says it's her favorite color. What should I do next? Well, that was a request from some people. I do not know who Kara is, or Chara, I guess if it's pronounced like that. Just that apparently Monica seems to share many similarities with whatever she is as a character. Some people requested that I do that, but I don't know why, and secondly, it's not giving me any specific new response.
So that's the last name I'm going to try, but it doesn't seem to, again, give the reaction I wanted. But anyway, you can call Monica Baca, apparently. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. I've been calling her names for a pretty long time, I guess. This is the third episode. And I'm not sure if I want to do a fourth one. I mean, if you want to leave a request, you can in the comments, but it's kind of getting a bit generic by now because most of the answers are generic. Anyway, thanks for watching. Do check out my other videos. Do leave a comment, leave a like, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos on Monica After Story. Thanks for watching.